everyone. Jason Williams here from Wattec. It's 2017, and with the new year, Wattec has rolled out some new cameras. Um, before I get into these new, these two new units, I just wanted to, uh, you know, express my appreciation for all of our followers out there and all loyal Wattec customers. And I really wanted to uh, take these these opportunities to um, not only show you new cameras, but I, I really want to look for your guys' feedback as to uh, what type of um, interface, uh, video output interfaces you guys require. Sure, we can come out with small cameras, analog. We've got some digital coming out this year as well. Um, but I really want to hear your voice. What do you guys need? What is your market demand from Wattec? Giggy, IEEE, um, USB 3.0, analog, you love it, you hate it. Tell me what you guys like. Um, fill me in. We're not going to get any better if you guys don't tell us what you want. Okay, we can make it everything in the world uh, as great as we think it is. Without your input, we're no good. So we've got to step up and make what you guys what you guys want, what you guys need, uh, with a Wattec spin on it, so that it's a uh, it's a high quality, uh, hard charging Wattec camera. So without further ado, this is the new one inch cubed, high resolution, low light, day night, uh, analog camera from Wattec. This is a 1200 CS. That's the model number. It's a one inch cubed, as I previously stated. Uh, it's 750 TV lines of color resolution. That's HD in an SD output. So that's a BNC output. So if you're using 250D2 cameras or 231S2 cameras, this is the next evolution. This is where you want to be. 750 TV lines versus your old 550 or even 600 TV lines in color with an, an SD output. So easily replace your, your, your older uh, 250Ds or your 231S cameras uh, with a 1200 CS. Available for purchase next month, March 2017. Um, this also sports our OSD menu port off the back, so you have access to all the features and functions of our cameras via the, US, uh, the OSD menu port off the back. Um, I can send out menu trees and uh, different specs and whatever you guys might need. Just hit me up. Again, Jason at WattechCameras.com. Give me a call, 888-567-4294. Visit us on the website at WattechCameras.com or Facebook. I kind of use them all. Um, I try and keep the data consistent, so what's on one should be on the others. Uh, sometimes the timing's a little off. but So if you require anything specific, let me know. Shoot me an email. I'll get it out to you. Uh, this does use the same... Uh, CB01 cable interface, so you've got your standard 12 volt power, BNC connector, and a little Molex connector off the back. All molded connections onto your cabling. Nice, clean uh, format for that. And like I said, it does support our OSD menu and the OSD uh, remote control, the RC01 that we typically use and consistent throughout all of our products that use these, that use these uh, accessories to access the OSD menu. Um, again, one inch cubed. 750 TV lines color resolution, 0 0.005 lux in color, 0 0.008 lux in black and white, 1200 CS, next evolution in Wattex analog camera series. Okay, moving on to the 920 CS. This is uh, extremely low light, 0 0.00005 lux, okay, in a one inch cubed camera. 570 TV lines of monochrome resolution, Okay, it's the next evolution in our 910 in our 900 series. This is a 910 uh, HX, if you guys can see that. Uh, this is a full body. It's about, about two inches or so deep by an inch and three quarters or so by about an inch by an inch. Okay, maybe a little over inch and a quarter by an inch and a quarter. Okay, um, everything you can do with this, you can now do with this one inch, this one inch cubed camera. Okay, the 920 CS. Okay, it does use our OSD menu port off the back. So you'll be able to access all the functions and features of the cameras, just like the 1200CS, just like the 910HX, and any other camera that uses the OSC menu. You would retain, you'd hit retain settings after you set it up to your application and your environment. Boom, you're good to go. Uh, you've got, you've got uh, basically a customized camera for your application and in, in, in your clients. So this is the next evolution. Both cameras support uh, two mounting holes on the top, the sides, and on the bottom. So you can mount the camera to the side wall, top wall, opposite side or bottom. Okay, we do make an L-shaped L, L bracket with a quarter 20 on the bottom and there's zero tolerance on that. So there's no move, there's no drag. Uh, it'll lock right into these, to these uh, threaded um, screw holes on the camera. Okay, again, 920 CS. Next evolution in the 900 series cameras. 1200 CS, next evolution in our color series. Both low light, 
One's extremely low light, that's the monochrome 920. Other one's extremely high resolution and low light camera as well. So next evolution in our color, day-night cameras and our, and our extreme, extremely low light monochrome cameras. New look, feel, and size from Wattac. Tell us what you think. Uh, if you don't tell us, you can't blame us for not making it. So uh, if you don't ask for it, we, we, don't, we can't even consider it. Let me know what you think. Hit us up, uh, Jason at wattechcameras.com. The website, wattechcameras.com. Hit C support or the uh, tech support on there. Let me know what you think. Put your comments in the bottom. Looking forward to sharing with you all the other digital formatted cameras that we have coming out this year. Um, stay tuned to be continued. Thanks for watching. Appreciate all your loyal support.